Hello guys, in this video, I will show you how to export a transparent background animation or project from Adobe After Effects CC. So I have got open in my After Effects a project is just a simple logo animation I have just created for my videos. I actually have a full separate video tutorial on how to create a custom logo animation from scratch. The link is in the description. But let's say we created something like this because we want to use it on several of our video projects. And just keep it always there so we'd want to export it in transparent background. Now if you click this little view toggle transparency button here you can check if you have a transparent background or not by toggling the view so normally. If it's off the after effects will just show you have against a black background. But you toggle it on you can see that pattern means that it's transparent. We just want to make sure that we don't have some sort of solid or image layers below the logo layers. If there is a black background make sure you delete all of your background layers. Simply click on composition and go to composition then select add to render queue. Click on lossless then select QuickTime from the format options. Go to video output and select RGB plus alpha channels. Finally, click on format options and select ping from video codecs. Click OK again click OK then press render. Now, let's check the video is rendered in the transparent background or not. Go to file select import then file. Select the rendered logo animation and click on import. Let's import a background. Click new composition with background video and drag and drop the transparent logo animation above the layer. Let's check. Perfect, it's working amazingly. Now, click on the transparent logo animation video and right click on it. Then select interpret footage then select main. It will loop over animations. We can loop it as many times as we want to. Now I want to loop my logo animation 5 times. So just add 5 and press OK I will loop our logo animations 5 times. We can decrease the logo size if we want. Just press S to open scale and reduce the scale amount. We can also drag the logo to the corner of our videos, just like that. Just decrease the opacity. Awesome! It working perfect!
I hope you've learned a lot from this tutorial and that you can apply these skills to your own workflow. Thanks for watching good luck and I'll see you next time on Rizat Graphics.